Welcome back to Sailing on La Venture. This week, we take a holiday sail over to Georgetown Exuma and enjoy all the festivities of Boxing Day. And this is the first time we've sailed over there in all these years. So everybody's pumped and excited to explore Georgetown. We're all covered up and I, I don't know if I can see that. We look like we're about to raid something. We don't want to get caught. Yep. <laughs> so what are we doing, Reese? Where, what are we about to do? We're covering up from the Nocios. Oh, and we're about to uh, pull it from the dock and start sailing to Georgetown. Okay, so why do you think there are so many no here right now? Because it's wet. Well, and, and we, what does the water look like out there? Green and It looks like glass. There's no wind. So there's lots of no out here. But once we get moving, we'll be fine, right? Yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay, it is a beautifully calm day and we are headed out. We're going to Georgetown. It's about a seven hour sail. So we left about eight. The water was glassy smooth when we left. We're getting a few ripples here, but it is going to be a gorgeous day. So we have the whole crew here and Damien, what do you think of today? Today, so far. So far, we're not really, we're not really sailing yet. We're motoring, but as soon as we clear Dub B, we're gonna put up the sail. Okay, we're headed to Great Exuma, Georgetown, chat and chill for a couple days. And we're about halfway across to the cut. It'll take us then inside the Shoals and Reefs to Georgetown Harbor and that bay area there off Stocking Island where we can anchor. Amazing day. It's about six knot wind to about 12. So kind of builds up and then softens and then builds up again. But the seas, as you can see, are very flat. Uh, so it's just a real smooth sailing day, perfect day to be out here. Keep on being good to 
Hello, Dad. We are having an interview. Okay. So, what is your favorite part about sailing on the venture? Sit next to my Reese's Peace on the bow. What's your favorite thing to eat on the venture? I haven't had any meat yet. But what is your favorite thing to eat? Lobster with mac and cheese and maybe a side of a grilled asparagus with a glass of fine wine. And what are you thinking about the sail today? Um, it is a beautiful, calm sail. It's exciting because it's a Pegasus first venture on the venture. It's handling it pretty well. We've almost seen the board of that thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so calm out here. There's nice rolly waves. And we have how much wind, Randy? Um, about 10 knots or so. Okay, so what do you have to say about where we're going? Where are we going? Well, we're going to uh, Georgetown, Great Exuma. And we're going to anchor off of Stocking Island? We are. Okay, tell us a little bit about our sail today and what we can expect as far as time getting there. And Well, we're hoping to be anchored by 3 o'clock. We're hoping to get to the cut around 2. And we're making good time. We're averaging a little under 6 knots. These are one to two feet, so much easier than the last time we came through. What a beautiful day. Beautiful white sails. Welcome. in there. So, Erin just got done making us these um, incredibly gourmet avocado um, crackers. So we always like her work because she makes things nice. Hey Peg, how are you doing out here? Lisa, how are you doing? So we're just off Great Exuma, Stocking Island. We're passing the windward side of Stocking Island and going up island to uh, make the conch key cut and then come back south and anchor. So we're going around conch key. You can see the little boat out there. Hey, so Erin and Damien, what are you doing right now? Have you spotted any, Damien? Okay. What a beautiful sail. And Emily, are you doing anything? Okay. We ought to have smooth sailing down the channel.
thought for, huh? Well, Damien, what do you think of Chat and Chill? Chill and play. <laughs> good so burgers, cool. Good atmosphere. Good sunset. It's like the coolest place in the whole world. Georgetown, Stocking Island, Great Exuma. Beautiful morning. We've already seen some dolphins. Um, as you look over there, there's Georgetown and Georgetown Harbor. And then as we look over here, you'll see some of the anchored boats off of Chat and Chill, Stocking Island. So we had a great evening, went ashore, had some appetizers, some beers, and uh, hit the hit the store uh, for some chat and chill shirts and hats. Today we're going to head over to Georgetown and walk the streets and check out the stores. It is the official day. Boxing Day was yesterday, but they observe it on this Monday too. So we'll see what's open in Georgetown. Um, we're just kind of watching the boats this morning move around and the sun come up and again We've had already a visit from some dolphins So are the dolphins gone Wasn't that cool Swim like a dolphin? Yeah. So guys, what are we going to do today? We're going to sail to the Great Field. I don't think so. Yeah, what was it Alina said when we were leaving last June? She said, we're going to sail to the Great Beyond. Uh, we're going to sail to the Great Beyond, otherwise known as Exuma. Oh, otherwise known as Ready, 
Well, I guess we're waiting, guys. Everything. It even has turmeric, it has garlic, it has all kinds of sprouts, it has um, all kinds of fresh fruits and vegetables and everything you could pretty much think of that you would want. So anyway, a lot of things are closed today because this is considered Boxing Day Observed and all of the government officials and offices are um, off today. on the official ruling for certain rules, so we're looking them up on Google. from Long Island to Stocking Island. And first, what we did is we went to chat and chill, which is kind of the touristy thing to do, right? That all the right, boats do? Right, last night, yes. And what did you think of chat and chill? I think everybody in the family loved it. They had a great time. They got these great music. shirts. Yep, had a great store, great music, lots of sand, a lot of fun. And now the sun's out and it is absolutely spectacular here we are kind of up on a hill at the church and nobody's at church it's Monday it's the observed Boxing Day holiday so not everything is open but the grocery store the market here is open and it's got great stuff you can get really anything you want here um, they've got great produce mm -hmm. they've got great um, sparkling waters we saw where there's ice pretty much they have everything that we want right so everybody's kind of wandering around the is this a village or a, a community? settlement yeah a settlement. georgetown but georgetown's big so the entire island of exuma has over six thousand people maybe more than that now it's pretty busy here it's um there's a lot of people that come over from Stocking Island to restock their boats. And just to kind of see, they have a great market. Yeah, it's kind of cruiser central for stocking, for fuel. So we're gonna give you a little view of Georgetown because it's a great place to come. So we are at the side of the church and you can kind of see that view from the church. Incredible. 
And these tombstones are really from 1860, 1852. They really go pretty far back. Look at the life these people lived. The population was pretty sparse back then. And these people who lived here were pretty rugged. They could survive a lot of conditions when you think of hurricanes and droughts and they built this place to what it is today. What a great day. Just a few clouds on the horizon. But it's such a pretty blue. Emily's paddle boarding to the beach. And everybody else is going over in the dinghy with a paddle board. Yeah. We play, no, we, we don't play over when I taught her how to play Yahtzee and Guess what, now I'm a pro at standing up. You look pretty professional there. I think you got it down. You're going to sleep well. Go up to the side of her? I'll come next to you. Try not to knock her over. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Oh, jeez. Grace for a pet. Grab my hand, grab my hand. Oh good! You've learned a lot. Oh, and I and I found out that. Um, and then, yeah, bring your foot pants. And then the knee right here. Uh, the guy from that boat, the one with the mizzen mast. Yeah. That was nice. But we were already on our way. Well, it's just these things keep going back and forth really fast, well, like not so paying any attention. Down. We have less. No, we have, we've never Actually, we have 20 minutes. We have 20 minutes. I have a little bit less than two meters. Yeah. I think it's good. morning we're headed back to Long Island uh, from Stocking Island, uh, Great Exuma, and we're headed back through the southern cut today. So we're navigating through reefs and rocks um, and shallows, but uh, we got some rocks ahead to get through and then we'll finally be in open water, get under full sail and head for Stella Maris, Long Island. What are you doing? Hey Reese's, we are about back to Long Island, so I am cleaning my room and I am putting all of our sheets in a pillowcase so that we can go wash it all. Wow. So we're about one hour and ten minutes from Long Island, right? Probably even closer than that. Oh. Let me check my app. Because last time I checked, we were 7.5 nautical miles, and now we are 4.5 nautical miles, and we're going a little over five knots per hour, so we should be there less than an hour. That is very interesting. Is it? Yes, it is. And we've been trying to play games, but we have no internet. Right? Makes things a little tough. Yes. We are in the middle of the sea. Yes. And we have to put on a lot of sunscreen and 
and <laughs> cover Reese up. perhaps puts on too much sunscreen. <laughs> <laughs> puts on about one layer every 30 minutes. No, I don't. I do every hour and a half. She puts on a new layer about every 23 minutes. She has currently about 13 layers of sunscreen on. No, I don't. <laughs> Yeah. No, I don't. At least, if not more. No, that's not true. Nothing has ever been truer. <laughs> well, we're just living a day in the life. Thanks for watching. We had a great three days in Georgetown, anchored off Stocking Island, exploring Chat and Chill and the settlement of Georgetown. Thanks to this week's crew, Lisa, Aaron, Reese, Emily, Damien, and of course, Pegasus celebrating his birthday with us. Have a great week, everyone. When the old one's gone under the knife And I can feel